Get ready to learn how to play the game of snag. Snag, the golf of the new millennium. What you just saw was a snagging out on a flag sticky. The target base snagged the ball. This is where the game of snag received its name. Snag is very similar to the game of golf. In golf, we play a hole and finish with a hole out. In snag, we play a sticky and finish snagging out to the flag sticky. The game is played with two clubs, the launcher and the roller. All shots must be played off of the launch pad with the launcher, except on the short stuff. When you are on the short stuff, you must use your roller. The short stuff may be marked off by using rope, chalk, or marking paint. The target is the flag sticky. It's a cylinder that is above the ground and covered with a hooked cloth material. So when the snag ball rolls up or bounces into it, it sticks to the base or snags out. To assemble the flag sticky, simply fill the cylinder with water, connect the flag, insert it into the cylinder, and you are ready to play. The purpose of the game of snag is to set up your sticky, then put your launch pad down and launch your snag ball toward the flag sticky. Once you're in the short stuff, the snagster rolls the snag ball into the flag sticky, snagging out. The lowest number of points, or shots, wins the sticky. Snag is designed to be played by people of all ages, sizes, and special needs. And more importantly, it can be played anywhere imaginable. A schoolyard, a beach, a golf course, a par 3 course, a gymnasium, or a park. It's unlimited. In fact, the world is your course. You can see that we have a very unique language that corresponds with the game of snag. So familiarize yourself with the terminology.